Let's kick off the weather with our sky cam from Tuscaloosa, high atop DCH Regional Medical Center. The sky there partly to mostly sunny. Cooling showers would be nice, but today they are very hard to find. We have a heat advisory in effect for much of Alabama. The county's in orange. This is where the heat index could hit 105. We'll check out the current heat levels, mostly low and mid 90s today. And again, this is about average for this time of the year. 91 for Anniston, Birmingham at 94, Tuscaloosa also at 94. But you factor in those high dew points. These are heat indices, and they're pretty nasty today. Triple digit heat values. We'll see this most afternoons, at least for the next five days, which is what we expect this time of the year. Here's the radar, and again, just not a single cooling shower in progress across the entire central part of the state today. The bulk of the showers and thunderstorms way down south, parts of south and southeast Alabama. We had some flash flood warnings in effect down here, some flood advisories as well, heavy rain falling around Eufaula, but all of that will stay down to the south. But tomorrow should be a different kind of day with a surface front coming in that will likely set the stage for some fairly active storms by tomorrow afternoon. Tonight will be a warm midsummer night. The sky mostly fair. Upper 70s in most spots in the city. We could stay in the 80s all night tonight. So tomorrow, this is the severe weather outlook from the Storm Prediction Center. We have a level 2 out of level 5. Slight risk of severe storms across the central part of the state. No tornado threat. The main issue, the chance of wet microbursts. Local areas of strong winds may be high enough to knock down some trees and power lines. Not raining everywhere, but where the storms do form, they will be quite strong. We have marginal risks on either side of that slight risk across the central part of the state. Quick peek at the tropics. Absolutely nothing going on today. The tropics are quiet. No tropical storms, no hurricanes for at least the next five days. This is Future View. This is the hour by hour forecast. Overnight tonight, the sky will be mostly fair. Most locations will drop in the 70s by daybreak. Now, tomorrow morning, we should be dry, but Tomorrow afternoon, the air becomes very unstable and storms will be forming. I promise the radar will not look exactly like this, but storms will be around. Not raining everywhere, but with the storms form, they could produce tremendous amounts of lightning, strong, maybe damaging straight line winds in spots, and very heavy amounts of rain. Those storms gradually drop on down to the south by tomorrow night. And after that, the weather looks relatively dry by Friday, Saturday, Sunday, with only isolated showers and storms. So tomorrow, 92 morning sunshine, strong storms by afternoon. Friday, Saturday, Sunday, only isolated storms. Many places dry. 92 Friday, mid 90s Saturday and Sunday, mid 90s every day next week. Lows in the 70s with those isolated pop up afternoon splash and dash storms.